still against this. If the feds see us with him, no telling what conclusion they'll draw. If you had done the job you were tasked with, we wouldn't be here. He's coming. Hello, Ali. Why isn't she saying anything? Is she trying to get inside my head? I still feel like she can hear us. I feel like she can see me. You're not going anywhere. I know you're working with my husband. Tell me where he is. Sorry. I don't know. You're being honest this time. But you're gonna find him for me. No one's gonna find him. I don't think I'll be able to do that. <laughs> and now you're back to lying. Should I tell her the truth? Should I tell her that her husband's dead? You do that, you'll guarantee we don't walk out of here alive. On my first date with Tyrell, I saw this stunning redhead wearing a pair of cubic zirconia earrings. I asked him what he would do to get me those earrings. He told me he would do whatever was necessary. I told him I wanted him to fuck that woman and bring me her earrings. The next morning, I woke up to a gift. These are the cheapest things I own, yet they're my favorite. Tyrell would always do what was necessary. And at the end of that, I would receive a gift. That's why I know he's alive. That's why he's been calling me. That's why he sent me this phone. Because he's doing what's necessary. You talk to him? He called me last night. That's impossible. He wants to let me know that he's okay. He has a plan. He told you that? No. We haven't spoken. He's protecting me. That's what you do for your partner. The calls come up as unknown. I've tried to have him trapped, but I've been unsuccessful. Is this something you might be able to accomplish? This bitch is blood simple, Elliot. She's the wife of the psycho who strangled that woman. The same psycho who was this close to doing the same to you. If we're around when she learns that Tyrell is dead, you don't think she'll have us killed? He's right. It's not worth it. I'm sorry. Can't help you. Do you really want to say no to me? <laughs>